Hi everybody, I'm going to do a few Lead Belly songs. I'm going to start out <clears throat> with the Midnight Special. I first learned this song back in elementary school. Uh, our music teacher taught it to us. And the story I always heard uh, was that back down in Texas uh, when Lead Belly was uh, in prison, uh, at the Sugarland prison down there, they had a, uh, a kind of a mythology around the uh, midnight special, the, the passenger train that came by late at night. And if you were on death row and the midnight special came by and the light shone through the bars, if it landed on you, it meant that uh, you were gonna walk free the next morning. Special by Lead Belly. Hudy Ledbetter, born in 1888. Uh, you know, when you have a name like Ledbetter, you know, Lead Belly seems like a pretty typical nickname, but apparently there's lots of stories about how he got it. Uh, apparently, you know, he used to be a big drinker and he could drink a lot of moonshine, or he was kind of a tough guy. Uh, not, not exactly sure uh, why that. One thing I learned is that I always thought Lead Belly was one word uh, as his name, but it's actually Lead Belly two words. So Midnight Special. Uh, so uh, when I was growing up, I had this uh, this album on Folkways, recorded back in 1950. Uh, Take this hammer, Lead Belly songs, and uh, yeah, it. it uh, didn't have the Midnight Special on it, but it did have uh, this next one I'm going to do, Bring Me a lot of, Little Water, Sylvie, and of course the one I'm going to finish up with, Goodnight Irene. So uh, this next song, in the liner notes for the Folkways album, it, uh, Lead Belly's quoted here, he says, July and August are really hot, and this man's wife, he's got a wife, and he calls her Sylvie. And the only way that he's going to get his cool water, he's got to call Sylvie to get his water down there. Because he's burning down hot. So he yells, Sylvie, Sylvie. So um, I actually grew up with two different versions of this song. One was from uh, 
Harry Belafonte and one was from Lead Belly. So today I'm going to kind of combine the two into uh, my version here. So. Sylvie from uh, the great Lead Belly. He had a illustrious career, uh, toured with the Weavers and Pete Seeger, uh, discovered by Alan Lomax, the great uh, folk song collector. Um, I think it was a mixed bag because I think there was also some exploitation there. Um, there's pictures of him dressed in prison pinstripes and there's stories of him being the chauffeur for the band as uh, as well as the uh, <laughs> one of the featured artists. So, uh, you know, mixed things, but great songs he did. Uh, this last one I'm gonna do, uh, Good Night Irene. Uh, many different versions, many different verses. A lot of his songs tended to be uh, on the risque uh, side. And in fact, when the Weavers recorded, they had to clean up uh, some of the lyrics to get by the censors and the record companies. Um, this particular song, um, I've, uh, I've heard uh, Lead Belly sing it as very explicit, I'll get you in my dreams. In the uh, version here on Folkways it says, I'll kiss you in my dreams. And I'm going to sing the way I learned it, which is I'll see you in my dreams. So here we go uh, with Goodnight Irene, a nice little lullaby. This is something, uh, this goes out to my friends in Hootenanny and our fans and our uh, folks, because uh, uh, this is one we would always often end the night with. So, good night, Irene. Yeah. <laughs> Saturday night I got married oh, Me and my wife's 
settle down. Oh, now that we are parted, think I'll take a walk downtown. Everyone, I ring a Pajamas, and sometimes she wears her nightgown. But when they're both at the cleaners, well, she's the talk of the town. to everyone. Uh, just one more thing. Uh, you might know that Ken Kesey, uh, who wrote One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, his, uh, his second album had the title of Once a Great, uh, uh, Once a Great Notion. Yeah. Uh, so it's, uh, it was based uh, on this song on, on Goodnight Irene from, from Lead Belly. So I'm sorry, Sometimes a Great Notion, right? All right. Take care, everyone. I hope you're well. See you next time.